So I was just browsing YouTube when I came across this video right here. In this video, randomly a gigantic tsunami spawns that flushes over the entire map. And as soon as I saw that, I thought to myself, I have to build this in build <laughs> So that is exactly what we're going to be doing today, guys. This build is going to be absolutely insane and probably going to make a whole bunch of people very, very angry. <laughs> Oh my god. So yeah, guys, actually, a very, very long time ago, I made this build right here called the Tsunami, and it actually didn't end up working. I think I actually did make a video about it. Like, I think I did post the video, but the build itself actually never really worked, guys. And the reason for that is because I powered the whole thing using pistons. And I don't know if you guys knew this, but pistons are very, very bad to use for this uh, situation. This is not the type of situation in which you would want to use pistons. So what does that leave me with? Well, guys, I'm going to recycle the tsunami pretty much is what I'm going to do, okay? This tsunami right here actually looks freaking amazing, and I think it would just be such a shame to actually just throw it in the bin. So, yeah, I'm going to just... Bye-bye. Uh, <laughs> And uh, yeah, we're going to keep this part right here. And dude, this wave actually looks freaking sick, in my opinion. This is going to look absolutely insane. Seeing this thing storm all the way from the end of the game to the front. Dude, just imagine. It would be insane. <laughs> all right. Now, for the mechanics that I actually do want to use, I am still not yet entirely sure. <laughs> I mean, at some point in the past, I also made this build right here, which was a, you know, a giant speeding wall, which is kind of the same idea. But this one also didn't end up working great. So <laughs> where does that leave me? I'm going to have to make a brand new mechanic. That is pretty much it. OK, I'm going to have to make a brand new mechanic. And this time around, I will make sure that it actually works flawlessly, <laughs> which is a big promise. All right. So first things first, what I'm actually going to do, guys, is I'm, I think I'm just going to move this whole thing right here way, 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 way down and select that and just, yeah, get this out of the way with just for now because I need some space to work on. Okay. So right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build the actual mechanic for a giant wave that it's going to flush all the way back to the spawn. So how am I going to do that? I don't know. <laughs> That's a really good question. Oh boy. <laughs> Yep, we're starting right away with the interesting and tricky mechanics, of course. All right, let's try it out, I guess. Maybe this will actually work out really good. So yeah, guys, pretty much I've created a, uh, I guess I could use the word circle here, a circle that has a very, very, very tiny gap from the actual pole right here. So it should actually be able to slide along pretty good, which usually it doesn't. So yeah, this is actually the exact issue I was worrying about getting. You see how it's getting stuck right now? Yeah, that's not good. Dang it. Okay, we gotta make an actually good mechanic. It's so hard. <laughs> Ugh. No, guys, I actually don't think this is going to work, but I might as well try it out with ice instead. Oh, it's actually sliding, though. It's still not great. All right, guys. So one thing I know for sure is that if I can actually make this work uh, with the metal pole, then it should actually be really, really smooth on ice. I hope this is going to work. I did something different here. I used two thrusters around the ring, and I think this might actually do it. So let's go. Oh, baby. Okay, that is actually starting to look freaking amazing. That's starting to look more like it. Yeah. You know what? Even more stabilization. Why not? All right, let's go with four. <laughs> and if everything goes according to plan, I just messed up. <laughs> if everything goes according to plan, this should actually be the one. Can I anchor it? Let's go. Oh, yeah, dude. That is it right there. That is amazing. Oh, okay, load it back in. Okay, guys, so one thing I'm actually noticing is right now the, the gap right here is 0 0.5. Sorry, no, no, 0 0.05. I think I can actually get that down to 0 0.01. <sighs> okay, you can no longer even tell that there's a gap there. All right, let's give it a shot. And it somehow got stuck. It was stuck on the top. All right, yeah. Okay, that's the one. Perfect. Okay, cool. So yeah, I made the I made the tolerance as small as I possibly could. It's pretty much what I just did. So yeah, there's a microscopic little gap in there, which is actually making it like a super smooth ride. Whew. Okay, so we've gotten the hardest part out of the way. Now we've gotten the actual thing that's gonna make the tsunami move. At least this part of the mechanic. <laughs> uh, there's a lot of stuff that we're still actually gonna have to do, sadly. Like, pretty much we're gonna have to build these tracks going all the way from the end of the game to the start, which is gonna take a minute. And then we're actually gonna have to attach a bladed tsunami to it. So yeah, there's a lot of work left to do. Oh God. Oh boy, this is gonna be nuts. <laughs> So yeah, guys, my idea to absolutely like optimize stability was to actually use a whole bunch of these boys. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's give that a shot. <laughs> this is gonna be something else, boys. Trust me. Three, two, one, go. And I don't know if you guys noticed, but that was 
very, very, very smooth. Almost perfect, some might say. So yeah, guys, to actually make all of this stuff, like, big enough, uh, what I'm gonna have to do is I'm actually gonna have to rotate everything on its side, which makes it very annoying to build with. That's why I started building uh, straight before I uh, did any of that. <laughs> because in the past, what I would do is I would just start uh, diagonal right away. Or vertical? Vertical. That's the word. And it pretty much messed everything up. All right, so I would say it's now about time to start uh, integrating the wave. <laughs> All right, guys, so this build is starting to get pretty confusing uh, pretty quickly. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but honestly, I think this is gonna turn out super freaking well, guys. Pretty much what I've got right now is I've got these five poles, which are gonna be the stabilizers, okay? So these are gonna make sure that no matter what, it's not gonna go all over the place, okay? I want it to go in a straight line, like a laser from the end all the way to the start, flushing the entire world. Now, some things that I still have to do. I have to make these poles way longer. Right now, they're like, I don't know, like 100 something studs. It's it's really not that great. And I still have to attach the actual tsunami to the uh, to, to the build. So yeah, uh, those are some things that I still have on the to-do list, but so far it's actually going pretty amazing. All right. Now I gotta just rotate these like so, so they're facing down and then move them all the way up, which is gonna take a moment. <laughs> all right, so this is looking pretty good. All right, <laughs> the final thing left to do, I'm pretty sure, is gonna be putting the tsunami on the actual system, which, oh boy, it's getting real. <laughs> okay, rotate it that way. All right, and we gotta just attach this as closely to here as we can. And I think that right there is perfect. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness me, dude, this is looking amazing. Actually, back in the day, it was super, super hard to actually build a lot of these parts right here. And at some point, I gave up on building that. And now that we actually have the clone tool, I might just actually quickly clone that over. <laughs> Another reason why the clone tool is amazing. Oh my god, that actually was... That actually was so stupid easy. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, fixed. Dope. Okay, cool. So just gonna make this stuff all a bit shorter because it doesn't need to be this long anymore. Alright! I think that's everything. Oh wait, no, I just forgot to select that part. It just... I, whatever, I left it over there. <laughs> I guess it's just deleted now. Alright! So, let's give this thing its first ever test Test run, which is probably gonna go horribly wrong, but I don't freaking care. I think it might actually go pretty good. Please just work out. <laughs> Please don't be a complete disaster. Please. Okay, sit down here, eat a cake, jump, select all, unanchored. Oh, wait, I gotta connect all that stuff. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, let me, let me, let me do, let me connect everything. That might be kind of important. Oh, Ooh. okay. That actually was so easy. No shot, no shot. Launch! The, the tsunami's coming! Oh, it's working! Oh my god! Oh my god! It was totally just working for a moment there. <gasps> oh! Okay, uh, did I mess something up there? Look it again. Oh my god, that was such a rush. <laughs> Okay, so there seems to be something a little bit wrong, but overall, it seems to be working pretty great, which is exactly what I was hoping to see. And I actually have a pretty good idea as to what was messing it up and exactly how it is that I can fix it. All right, maybe this might be able to fix it. <laughs> Let me actually try it out. Okay, guys, this should actually create a gigantic bunch of... Um, uh, what are they called? Uh, shield generators, which actually should be able to protect the actual build. I think that's what was messing it up. All right, let's try it out. Activate. Okay, okay, we can see portals going. Okay, so the whole thing is actually making its way to here, but the portals aren't actually activated, right? <laughs> Okay, so the portals aren't activated, but they're still protecting the build enough to make it actually freaking work. Yes! Okay, now I need to move the entire build a little bit to the left. <laughs> it just got stuck there. But Come on, okay, if I do this, this should actually show you how good it is. Okay, I did not do it. <laughs> Dude, this is, this is turning out amazing. Clear the rocks! Clear all the bloody rocks! Ooh! Oh, but that kind of... That kind of did it, though, man. So yeah, guys, I was just thinking about it, and I was thinking about the fact that the rocks just literally always ruin it. So what if I got rid of them before I actually launched the tsunami? And it seems to be a pretty big success. <laughs> Dude, this is turning out so complicated, but I love it. This is literally going to be the best mechanic I have ever made for anything even close to this. It's so cool. So yeah, I'm going to pretty much as soon as we get to the end of the, uh, <laughs> as soon as we get to the tsunami, we're pretty much just going to be destroying, uh, the actual, <laughs> these right here. Uh, so they're gonna just fall into the void. Yeah. All right, guys. So now whenever the time is right, and I have to, I should be able to, disband the whole thing. And it just simply crumbles. There it is. Perfect. So yeah, whenever we actually have to destroy the whole thing uh, to actually launch the tsunami, we now can. And I think with that, we have actually collected every single one of the mechanics necessary to finish this entire build. Oh boy. <laughs> so yeah, first things first, let me start off with a fresh new server. All right, guys. If this is starting to look like a 
bit of a wire mess? That is because it is. I need to, in the right order, activate every single one of the components to make this entire thing actually function, which is, believe it or not, not that easy. <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's what I'm doing right now. All right, so we got this first part here fully done, I think. So I can delete these levers right here. Yeah, okay. Everything is only connecting down to the bottom now. So the only part that is left is way up here, uh, the, the tsunami itself and the activation of everything related to it. All right, baby, the final freaking step. Come on. As soon as I've done this, I think it's done. <laughs> okay, and now each of these needs to go into one another. Okay, now all I have left to do is the actual timings, which should be pretty simple. And I need a button right here, which activates, uh, yeah, this little chain of events. Delete that. Okay, timings. <laughs> all right, the time has come to test the entire thing out. And I really hope this is gonna work out because if it doesn't, I'm gonna cry. I will cry. <laughs> all right. Okay, I'm gonna just save one more time just to be sure. <laughs> okay, select all, unanchored, sit down. And then I anchor this part right here and then I can just delete all this stuff. All right, guys, so if I'm not mistaken, as soon as I press this button right here, it should clear all the rocks. And as soon as it's done so, send a gigantic tsunami my way. Three, two, one, go. Okay, something went wrong. Oh, wait, no, 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 it's not. No, it didn't go wrong. It actually went right, it was just lagging. Yes! Okay, 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 okay. So, okay, that was it's working! Okay, I messed one thing up. Oh my god. The uh the uh, the the, uh, the the rock clearing uh machine. It's supposed to actually be collision off. So that way it actually like disappears and stuff. <gasps> it's actually working! <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't believe it. Okay. So yeah, all of that stuff right there is actually supposed to be collision off. Go. So yeah, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, this time around, it should go better. I think it's lagging again. I don't know. Yeah, it just looks like it's standing still, but it actually isn't. Okay, so it's doing its thing. It's doing its thing. And then, yeah, as you guys can see, it just completely freaks out. But perfectly in time for the giant freaking wave to come and it's freaking coming dude oh my goodness me oh my god <laughs> All right, there it is. It's perfect. Okay, let me actually make all of the individual parts uh, invisible now, and then it's literally done. There it is. I think I think this is it. I think it's actually fully done now. <laughs> and I can't even see what I'm doing, which makes this whole thing a little bit confusing. Oh, whatever. I don't freaking care, dude. Let's give it a shot. Okay, everything is in place. Anchor that. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Okay, so you can see there is some particle effects going on, but don't worry about them, okay? They're, they don't matter at all, okay? They, 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 doesn't matter. The rocks are just magically clearing away. <laughs> and then as soon as that's done, the wave starts to appear. <laughs> oh my God, dude. That is so sick. Oh my God. Okay. So I'm noticing one slight problem. The wave is kind of getting stuck right there. Let me make everything visible. <sighs> oh my God, man. I'm starting to get like a, like a, like a, like a dopamine rush right now from this build. This is really sick. Oh, it's because this is getting stuck into the wave, which is not supposed to freaking happen, but it's happening anyway. Wait, I can actually fix that though okay i can actually pretty easily fix that all right let's do a fully visible test is that okay everything good all right three two one go it's doing its thing oh no it didn't it died <sighs> it's starting to get stuck ah! Ah! i spent the last hour trying to figure this problem out apparently i i just i just got my numbers wrong look the hole is here the floor is there this whole thing just needs to be raised up by like three blocks oh my god oh i'm i i don't i don't know if i can handle this right now <laughs> I, I went through so much emotional feeling. <laughs> uh, I guess I gotta just raise it up three blocks. <laughs> Check your numbers, boys. I, I gotta tell you. Oh my God. All right, this is all I have to do. <laughs> Oh, All right, that's it. That is literally it. All right, well, let's try it out. The final version. I hope if there's another problem, I'm actually gonna cry, but I'm fairly confident that this is it. All right, guys, I'm just gonna make everything visible just for now, just to make sure that we can see everything working flawlessly. Three, two, one, go. Okay, the whole thing is running, baby. Okay, it clears all of the crap. Okay, perfect. The crap has been cleared. It gets demolished. And then the freaking wave comes. Woo! Yes! Okay, I need to move the w the entire build a couple studs to the right. Like, two studs. Oh my god, this is amazing. Oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> Go! 
go! Okay. The fire's activated. The fire's freaking going. The rocks are cleared. Come on, come on, come on. And the tsunami flies through. Oh my God. Yes. Oh my God, dude. That is so sick. We finally freaking did it, baby. We have a working tsunami that comes from the end to the start. Obviously, it doesn't come from all the way to the end because honestly, I think that would actually be impossible. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I think it's about time that we try this thing out on some real people. So let's freaking do it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have one guy sailing off into the water. Okay, there's a very big boat loading, uh, which is not what I was hoping to see, but it's whatever. I don't freaking care, dude. Okay. <laughs> okay he's coming towards me, but I don't freaking care. Clear the rocks. Let's go. <laughs> All right. Hello, little guy. Are you ready to get tsunamied? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> my man got freaking tsunamied, man. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. I can't believe it actually worked that well. He actually almost got flung all the way onto my plot. <laughs> oh, that was sick. <laughs> All right, baby, there's a bunch of stuff in the water. Let's do it one more time. <laughs> Activate! All right, so we're clearing all the freaking rocks right now. Oh, yeah, the rocks are being cleared. <laughs> oh, my God, that guy's not going to have a good day. Oh, my God! Oh, my God! We just... <laughs> oh, my God. We just flushed everyone back. <laughs> It got kind of stuck there. It doesn't really love it when people are, like, actually getting hit by it. But, dude, that is so freaking cool, man. But guys, with that, we're going to be ending off today's video. This took me, like, way too much time to build. So, please, uh, actually subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed the video. Because that lets me know that you guys want to see videos like these. So, guys, with that, I'll see you later, boys. Peace.